Hey everyone, this is Randy Malden getting ready to do the Supply Chain Management Boot Camp where we're going to go through the CPSM Certification Exam training over the next three weeks. We start with Exam 1 next week and then the week after that Exam 2 and Exam 3. What this video is here to show you is what we're going to be doing and some expectations and also to show you around a virtual classroom and what to expect. So let's go ahead and get started. First of all, welcome. I really appreciate your investment of time to get through the CPSM Virtual Boot Camp. We know that the COVID has affected a lot of us in a lot of different ways. And this was our solution to help you get back on track. Whether you've been through our training before and never got through the certification process or you're just here for continuing education hours, I want to welcome you to the training because this is not only going to be different but it's going to be a lot of fun and then you'll hear about that a little bit later what I want to make sure you know now is preparation what do you need to do before the boot camp begins first of all you want to make sure you have access to the online training portal where you will find the online video webinars that we've done in the past this is very detailed training it is more detailed than what we're going to experience in the boot camp because the boot camp is more focused on those tasks with the most questions and helping drive home the main points, not so much the detailed studying that you need to do. So that's where you're going to find that detailed information inside the online portal along with the CPSM learning system that we're going to provide to you. When you go into the online portal, you want to make sure you watch all the videos. Now, you may not have had the chance to watch all the videos before the boot camp started. That's A-OK. -okay. What you want to do is make sure you watch all the videos before you take the diagnostic test. And I mean all the videos, exam one, two, and exam three, because you need to understand all three exams in order to be successful on any one exam because all the content works together so make sure you watch all the videos as I mentioned the CPSM learning system you should have that if you've attended our live boot camps in the past or it's on the way to you if you just registered for the training some of us just registered today and, and some are gearing up to register tomorrow and so once we receive the payment we'll be sending out those learning systems but you don't need them for the boot camp itself it's only required after class not during class you need to have it but you don't need it for the boot camp classes themselves because we're gonna have some training and stuff going on there but you're going to need it for after class because that's when you're going to need to fill in the worksheets which we'll talk about here a little bit later what technology do you need you need to have a laptop computer so that you can you know of course participate in the training access to the internet you want to because this is going to be the learning platform which I'll show you here in a few minutes you'll be able to see the learning platform that we're going to use it'll be Zoho Showtime so you want to make sure that you have access via your IT department we'll send you out a link and it is secure it has all those things but you want to make sure you have sufficient bandwidth you want to make sure you have a camera just like you have here right now because we're going to do some interactive training where you're going to meet with your teams you're going to be able to see them and talk to them with a microphone a headset just like I'm wearing now, noise canceling headset, or if you've got some other kind of microphone, that's okay too. But a means to communicate more than chat. This is an interactive training, not just me speaking to you. There are going to be questions. We're going to have games. We're going to have some other things. You'll hear about that a little bit later. But again, you want to make sure you have a laptop computer, a sufficient internet access, a video camera, and a headset with a microphone so that you can hear and you can talk and people can hear you as well. A noise canceling microphone is really nice. You want to make sure that you stay on mute unless you're talking. Why? Because there's no always somebody has a dog barking or the neighbor's working on something. Something's going on that you may even hear this with me next week because they're working on my roof. We may have a lot of banging going on. So that's why you want to have a noise canceling headset so that you don't hear that banging. And so you want to make sure that I have that and then mute when we're not talking. Okay. What are our expectations? One is that you need to attend. Attendance is mandatory and required because it's going to be interactive and we're going to be having our teams. It's all sessions. You need to be here for the guarantee. If we're having a live boot camp training, you'd be in class. I would see you as long as you're attending class, you're participating. I know you're getting the information that you need to pass the exam. So it's required for you to be in all sessions 
for the guarantee. If you're not going to make it for some reason, let me know and we'll talk about what we need to do. The team needs you. Your team is going to be put together each day. We're going to have different teams. So you'll rotate in between the different people and you'll work on different projects and case studies. And so you'll, you'll need to be here. If you're not here, the team is going to miss you and the team experience is not going to be as exciting and as participatory because we're going to have less people on the teams. Right now we have about 13 people scheduled. So that's really, really good, especially for the first time we're doing this virtual boot camp. In the future, we expect to have anywhere from 15 to 25. So if you know of other people that want to participate in this training, definitely shoot them over get them registered so we can get them involved there will be no recordings of the boot camp what does that mean that if you miss a session you miss the session okay because it's a boot camp experience if you were going through live training you wouldn't be able to go back and see it again if you miss certain content you can go back into the online portal and watch that detailed training to get information that you need for the worksheets and for the other information you're just not going to have that boot camp experience so you need to set aside time you need to tell people you're going to be busy and block off that time be present be participating it's going to be one of those trainings my intent my focus is to make sure that you are here present and experiencing a training versus just sitting here listening to the screen working on a computer over here say yeah randy that's nice no if you want that kind of experience do the online training. You don't need to waste my time nor your time sitting here listening to me have a whole bunch of fun without you. Instead, do something different. I want you here. I want you present. If you miss it, you miss it. That's okay. What else we got going on? I need your participation. We're going to have lots of games, which are going to be exciting. I have a new software platform that's going to enable us to play some games. We're going to have our contest every day at the end of the day, maybe in a few times throughout the day. We're going to have some contests. We're going to win prizes. Some prizes, we'll talk about those a little bit later, but basically be answering questions, and those who get the most right are going to be successful and win some pretty cool stuff, and it's going to be more contests than what you're used to. We're going to have quizzes to drive home the points that we're trying to make during the training, and we're going to have team activities. Those team activities can consist of case studies. They may be certain projects, things that you need to get done, again, to drive home certain points. This is a boot camp to drive home points so you can pass the test. The detailed studying needs to be done through the online portals, which are detailed curriculum, in the study guides, and the diagnostic tests, which are going to evaluate your learning and let you know you're ready to take the actual certification exams. You can do all that on your own. This online training virtual boot camp is supposed to be fun, participative, and having lots of activities. And that's our goal. What's our daily schedule going to be like? Every day we are going to start at 1 p.m. Eastern Time. For those on the West Coast, it'll be 10 a.m. your time. And then, of course, those can adjust accordingly depending upon where you are in the world. Once we get started, we'll be doing our welcome and agenda, and then we'll go into presentation one. We'll do presentation one, and about 1.50, we'll take a break because I know that sitting here on the computer is kind of boring sometimes. If you're not participating, I'm not going to be boring. Believe me, I'm not going to be boring. We're going to have more. we got cameras like this. i got all kinds of stuff set up. I'll kind of give you an insight to what's going on over here. See that? i got a whole studio set up just for you guys. It's going to be a good time. Okay, so we're going to take a break around 1.50, go to the bathroom, get some snacks, do what you need to do, and then we're going to come back. We're going to do presentation number two. Once we do presentation number two, then we'll take another break about 2.50. As you can kind of see, every 50 minutes, we're going to have, you know, a break. So don't worry, uh, you know, you'll, you'll be able to get bathroom, get water, have your snacks, stay, stay focused. Then we're going to get started with presentation three. And then at the end of the day, about 3.50, we're going to wrap it up, review what we've done, talk about what we're going to do, and then we're going to have our contest which then you get to win some prizes. Again, we'll talk about those here in a few minutes. All right, and then we're going to wrap it up. We're going to stop right at 4 p.m. sharp Eastern, and then the next day we're going to pick it up. So each day, three days, exam one, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Then the following week will be exam two, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Exam three, week three, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, just like this. Start at 1 p.m. and at 4 p.m. Eastern. It's going to, again, be a lot of fun. I'm really getting excited because I, I, I know this is going to be fun. I want to have have some cool shirts on but we're gonna have some good activities i'm going to share those activities here in a few minutes 
about some good stuff that we got going on. We'll do our presentation every day. This will be me lecturing you via slides. I'll show you those slides in a minute. During those slides, we're going to have quizzes. we got some really fun, interactive ways to teach more than just sitting there looking at slides. It's going to be a lot of fun. Okay. Once we do the presentation, you're going to have your workbook. I'll share with you the workbook. The workbook is going to be sent out on Monday. What we expect you to do with that workbook is go ahead and print it out so that you can take notes with it. Those of you who attended the live boot camp, you may have that workbook still and you want to make sure that you have that to take your notes. You may already have it filled out so you'll be able to reiterate notes that you've already taken, highlight things that you may have forgotten, add notes that you may need to add to keep that going, print out and take those notes with you. So this is going to be the way you're going to keep up and we're going to have that go through. Even if we don't cover it in the boot camp, you need to complete every question in that workbook. That is to ensure that you cover every single piece of content that you need to cover to be successful on the certification exams. So you want to complete all the sections. Again, I'll share you with you the workbooks here in a few minutes. Okay. Once you complete all the sections, each day what we cover, we're going to cover certain sections like task 1A, task 1B will be day 1, task C, D, F, and G will be day two, and then task E will be day three, one E. That's going to be our exam one. So at the end of each day, you want to go back to the worksheets and fill in that content that we may not cover during the boot camp. Go back to your actual online training modules, fill in that content, look at your study guides to find that information as well. And anything that's not filled in, you can send me an email or cover it. At the end of the day, we'll make sure that we fill in that information. The goal is by the end of the day on Thursday, all that information is filled in those worksheets. Where are you going to find those answers? You're going to find them in the presentations. You're going to find them in the study guides. You're going to find them in the online modules. You're going to find them in the in wherever you need to find the information and wherever you don't find the information you're going to ask me so that we can fill in that content for you what all this does with these worksheets is it takes all this information you bring it books you know this big all this content and you're going to put it down into worksheets about like this which becomes your cliff notes to prepare and study for the exam and continue to study for the exam okay what else are we going to do lots of games we're going to have contests, games, other things going on, competitions, not only as individuals, your participation in the team is going to add to your points, which ultimately leads to the grand prize at the end of the week. The person who has the most points at the end of the week is going to win a grand prize, which is an Amazon e-gift card, $100. $100 will come to you at the end of the week. But throughout the week, there will be additional tasks, additional opportunities to win some prizes. Now, our virtual conference room, I'll share with you in a few minutes. It'll be link will be provided the day before class, so you can go ahead and register and show up. I'll go through that here in a second. Come in, make sure you share that link with nobody but you because those who have not invested in this training don't deserve this training because we're gonna, again we're gonna have a lot of fun go into the conference room log in and participate we've talked about participating complete our activities and we'll be good to go okay let me back up for a second here what I didn't talk about here was specifically teams during our classrooms you will be assigned to a team during the presentations, you'll be given case studies, and then as a team, you will go to your virtual conference room. That virtual conference room is basically a Google meeting link, which hopefully if you can't participate in Google, that's okay, everyone knows, but it's the meeting, Google meeting, the new service that they provided due to COVID, and everyone, each team is going to have their own unique link. You'll click that link, it'll be available to us throughout the classroom. You go into that classroom, you talk about the case study, you have conversations, and then you come back to the main classroom where we'll actually discuss the case study as a group. Okay, We'll demonstrate that on day one so that you can actually know exactly what we're talking about, but just know that we will be working as teams, working as teams. Okay. All right, so go in the conference room, complete the activity, come back to the main classroom, and you will be all set. Okay, what else we got going on? What are the different prizes 
the uh, different prizes are going to be, like I mentioned before, Amazon e gift cards. What that means is that we have daily prizes for people that participate and earn points at the end of the day. One person will earn a $25 gift card from Amazon. At the end of the week, the person who has the most points it will earn a $100 e gift card from Amazon.com. That means if you win the competition every day, that's $75. At the end of the week, you can add on top of that $100. You can end up with $175. So why am I doing that? To bribe you to play with me and to participate in the classes. All right, so you got to pay attention. You got to be able to answer the questions at the end of the day, wrap up contest, and then you'll earn your points. Okay, as well as your team participation. So our team, if you show up for your team and you do well for your team, those points will be added up towards the end of the week so that someone who may not be winning at the beginning of the week may take it all in the last day. All right. So that's how we're going to work the contest. Those are the different prizes we're going to have. And one person will earn the grand prize at the end of the week. And we'll do that week two. And we'll do that in week three. So if you are coming to class and having a good time and enjoying yourself and earning lots of points, you could actually pay for this entire training. Or at least take your significant other out to a nice dinner by the time it's all over. Okay, so with that, let me go ahead and escape this. Let me share with you some other things that we got going on. For example, here is our virtual classroom. As you can see, I'm right here, but you see me here, but this is my camera over here. So you need to have a camera on your computer with headphones and again, keeping it on mute. As you go through here, we're going to have our people. We'll be able to see, we're going to have questions. So if you have a question, you can ask, ask the question. I'll see it here and I'll be able to answer that question for you. We'll have different polls. We're actually going to use a different software for polls and questions. Then it's going to be a lot more fun. It's going to keep track of your points and keep things going. Our chat, which we'll be able to have here. You can chat to me any questions that you might have. Handouts that we'll have each day will be available here where we find your case studies and those things. And ultimately, again, I can unmute people. Once I have people in here, I'm able to unmute them, allow them to talk, show their, their, uh, their cameras, and those type of things. And plus, you're going to need this for our Google meetings when we do our team activities. So make sure that you go to Zoho Showtime, see what's going on there. You'll see the presentation there. Make sure you have the technology that you are allowed to access those links. All right. So make sure that you are good to go. Okay. So that's just a demonstration of how it's all going to work. All right. So this is the video. Kind of give you an idea. Hopefully you're getting excited. Getting excited to do this training. It's going to be a lot of fun. We still have a few spaces left. So if you know of anyone else that wants to join us, please send them to the website or shoot me a link. We'll make sure they get registered. we got about maybe you know three or four more spots where we can get more people in. And the more people we have, the more fun the team exercises are going to be and the more interactive the training is going to be. And we're going to have a lot more fun. All right. So, again, take this video. Enjoy it. Write down any questions. Shoot me those questions in the response to the email that we'll send out to you. Go ahead and reply to that at randy at cpsmtraining.com. And, you know, just shoot me any questions, any things that you have. Again, make sure you have your CPSM learning system. Make sure that you have it from the boot camp or it's on the way meaning I've sent you a status to make sure that you, you have it there again you don't need it during the boot camp you're gonna to wanna to have it for after the classes and for after the boot camp to make sure that you can study the detailed information that you're gonna to need to study alright so with that I look forward to seeing you next week we're gonna have a great time and have a wonderful day take care and bye bye